Let's play cards. Y'all hit the hit the heart if you if you're stopping and watching. It's just it's just it's just courtesy, please, so that more people will see me. If y'all aren't hitting the button, it's 200 to 300 people watch these videos every time I post them. It goes right up to two 300. Can we get past that? I like barely have any 400s. So hit the button so other people can see it. I greatly appreciate you. Somebody could be dealing with a Leo, but we just did Leo, so we're not doing that. Who are you? Taurus. We already did Taurus too, so we're gonna skip that. So those those are people you might be dealing with. Capricorn. All right. We already said some of the signs you might be dealing with, so let's go ahead. Cancer, Aries, Virgo, Pisces, Aquarius, Taurus, this card. Leo, another person that is a Leo like yourself. Uh, these don't have to be people energies. They could be coming from you. They're just the biggest energies around you. Which to say, you know what, all 12 are kind of around you. People are uh, feeling uh, feeling the heat, it feels like. Uh, you're not the only person that's got extra stuff going on. A lot of people got extra stuff going on. So let's go ahead and have a look, see what you've got going on. Ugh. Start by doing what's necessary, then do what's possible, and suddenly you're doing the impossible. And so, you know, like I said, you got a lot going on. Francis of Asai, I don't know, I don't know what, what that person, who they did. They did say that. Names and initials may or may not be rele relevant, but I feel like that person may have something to do with something other than that. I don't know who they are, so I'd have to look it up. We don't have time for that on YouTube. A deep gnosis. See, you know the shits already. Somebody's very empathic. They're hypersensitive. There's too many people around. Somebody's looking to get themselves grounded and to put like a... A, a barrier up around them let's go ahead and take that and i would say the universe is listening here with the blessings but you also need to take uh there's no place like home your authentic self don't allow the people to treat you in a manner that you wouldn't treat them and if you're doing that you should carry on so yeah carry on our way with souls is a blessing uh play uh so i would say watch the alcohol or whatever go enjoy yourself do do whatever you do a lot of celebrations coming out. Don't be so serious. I swear, almost all the all the readings so far today have talked about celebrations. Not to say they're not shitty shit in them, but, you know, that's the stuff that we need to know. Not, not the rainbows and butterflies. Those are other people's uh, jobs, not mine. Blessings. You are being showered with light. Your creativity is being stirred. Activate satellite. An endless stream of rainbow color stems from your heart. Yeah, I would just chill out. And look at, you're like a beacon of light. So you do definitely need to protect yourself and your energy and learn learn to do it better, I would say. Maybe that's exactly what you are doing or something you're, you're going, shut the fuck up. Any, I'm talking to me, the other me's, whatever. 76, somebody could be 76, I'm not really sure. Uh, uh, plot a course of action, the hypersensitive, uh, I, you need to clear out your chakras because you have a great purpose. Um, we all have a great purpose. Like, you're not special. I'm not special. We're all psychics, but we are very unique and special. So, it's a yes and a no thing at the same time. You already know the things that you're supposed to be doing here. Someone could be a twin flame or something like that, or somebody's hanging on to the one. But, you know, the energies are very apparent to you. So, why don't you listen to yourself? I'm not really sure. Steady movement forward. Carry on. Carry on. All right, accomplishments here. I, I would say this is more about the blocking, uh, the boundaries. Restrict the people from coming towards your light. If you can't, you're going to be in trouble because people are, like, sucking you dry. Um, here we go. So this is spiritual learning. Um, and there is the letting go of the waterfall. At some point, the dam is going to break here. There is being too much pent up. There's too many things going on for things to be positive, for the moving forward to, you know, build a better foundation. Somebody could be crying a lot. There's a stalemate right there. What's this right here? It's having to do with the home. There's a home right here. We're going to take out the shits. But this is boundaries family the legacy of somebody could be daggling that in somebody's face all the time there is some competition around here and i just you know it's up to you to to remove the opponents from your life but don't remove them without having a conversation and if you can't fix stupid you can't fix stupid all right next one being your authentic self that's a problem for you you can't who you maybe you don't even know who you are somebody doesn't know who they are this is a conversation you're having with someone they're having with you i don't know i'm just collecting a bunch of energies and spitting them out so that they make sense here okay so there's definitely some sort of delays maybe about somebody coming home or leaving a home or somebody's very stubborn about the things in the home uh maybe this isn't even somebody's motherfucking home i i, I don't know let's see element of spirit the akashic records omnipresent uh source energy your soul is definitely saying you know what like 
let's let's say like this is the 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 foundation that's on the ground and this is as above so below like your higher and lower self needs protection your your spirit guides are trying to help you they're trying to communicate with you you're trying to communicate with someone to be helpful and i feel like the fox is like well that ain't motherfucking helpful this could be a daughter or a child or have something to do with some children here the new beginnings and i just saw the motherfucking beaver i'm like y'all here he is that's what i said i said what i said i think i said it in this one the beaver's working against themselves that's all about family too the beaver likes to take care of the family. I don't know. People aren't laughing enough, quite possibly. Or somebody is a fool. Or somebody's wearing a mask and they're not who they seem to be here. Something could have to do with a Libra. A justice. There's some in... in yeah, wow. Justice and justice twice. Look, I said justice. This motherfucker came flying out. Justice. Look at Justice. So... I said what I said. Something may have to do with court here. Somebody could be ill. Um, I also feel like the theories of the last verse is right and the secrets and all that shit. People are having a fucking a breakdown in the learning of it. Somebody could be looking for a new job here. Uh, somebody's experience has told them that it's time to move the fuck on. Somebody's not getting paid for, for their their time, their gnosis. Ooh, there's a grave, an explosion. Ooh, the dead people are most definitely around you and there's a priest. So this is a confession. I'm spitting all over myself today, but whatever. You can't. You. It's not getting to you. Uh, anywho, forgiveness. I keep people maybe keep forgiving the unforgivable. There's skeletons in the closet. Uh, and maybe someone's like, well, uh, I'm not going to ever take them out and look at them. So they're always going to be there and they're always going to be a problem. Oh, boy. A worry. A worry is a wasted emotion. It's time for people to stand up for themselves. There is some sort of fiery explosion. Uh, there may be explosives somewhere. Uh, resistance movement. I think people are just, uh, they have been blinded. They have, I don't know, y'all, this talks about a bomb and demol demolishing things. Uh, somebody may have an explosive temper. Somebody could have to go to the ER. I also feel like there's some sort of witch burning, some sort of, mm -hmm, something like that. It's an energy hierarchy, shaman. So definitely needing healing. Maybe you are the healer and you're just out of whack here and you just need to, need to go out and Ooh, somebody gonna dig their own motherfucking grave here where they already have. Ah! Somebody could just be morbid. Maybe they're getting old with the 76 stuff. There's some sort of tragedy with this explosion here. I don't know what to say about this shit. But we already know there's funerals and, and stuff going on because there's a lot of people dying right now and there's so much death in the air. It's hard to fucking get around it and find the happy stuff. But again, that's not my, that's not my job. That's somebody else's job. Anywho, I'm going to try to tell you the stuff that you need to be really aware of. So there's definitely supernatural demon things around you. I have been talking about a shark a lot. You might want to look up that energy. Somebody wants to like bite your head off or eat you for dinner or some shit. I don't know. Somebody's doing a lot of wishing. But what are you going to do with the wishes if you're not going out to get the things? And I don't know. Are people wishing bad shit on people? Quite possibly. If you can dream it, you can achieve it. You will get all you want in life if you help enough other people get what they want. Zig Ziglar, uh, maybe this is some shits that people need to learn from somebody else in order to fulfill your, your dreams and prophecies. Maybe somebody needs some sort of mentor motivation here. Well done is better than well said. And that's how you manifest with the universe. Uh, positive begets more positive. Negative, you know what it is when you add negative two plus negative two, it's negative four. You don't get any better staying in the positive unless you can find the motherfucking positive. Say what you mean and mean what you say. Great peace have they which love thy law and nothing shall offend them. This is a spiritual warfare as above, so below. It's happening all in front of everybody's faces, the unimaginable. The happiness of your life depends on the quality of your thoughts, which you control. There is definitely some faded event. Some shits come, come around. I did, they did say dig in their own grave. This says come full circle. It's karma. It is also an unavoidable like tragedy or some shits like that. Also, the priest is out here with a confession. <clears throat> In order to, you know, go to the right places at the end and, and stand stand for the judgment, first of all, the people here don't do the judgment, right? That happens after death. So don't listen to the people. Uh, if it, Listen to yourself. You know best what's best for you. So if you, and you can't fix stupid. So if you can't fix it, it's a lesson for you to walk away and stop trying to fix the stupid people because you're draining and you're taking from yourself which is the most important person in your life. Stop giving it away for free when you can charge for it. What is, it's like, don't give the milk away. Why, why would people buy the milk if they could take the whole motherfucking cow? Okay, it's time to let go of some people, places, and things here. And maybe you're just gonna have to 